Yo guys, kamusta ako nga ba si Orange and welcome back to my channel. So on today's video, pag-uusapan natin ngayon kung ano, ano ba ang skill ng Mage, Wizard, High Wiz. No? So, so, Mage hanggang High Wiz, papakita ako sa inyo kung ano yung mga skill, no? Para to sa mga, ano, sa mga nagtatanong kung ano, ano ba yung, kung ano, ano ba yung skill ng Mage dito sa Ralvarok X, no? And para to sa mga walang idea sa game, and... Titignan pala lang kung mag ba sila or what. So, ito, papakita ko sa inyo lahat ng skills ng mage. No? Okay, so, una-una, no? Sa mage skills, medyo, meron siyang magic crusher. Deal 200%, uh, hindi, mali pala yan. Oh, so, ito, magic crusher, deal 115% magic attack, plus 280, neutral magic damage on enemy use. Okay na, just skill, okay? So, kabasahin ko na rin sa inyo, guys, kasi... Ibang, may mga na ibang skill dito sa classic and sa eternal love kung nagaro kayo or sa origin so babasa isa isa na rin natin no? isa isa na rin natin siya so firebolt call down na firebolt on an enemy dealing 110% magic attack damage fire magic damage okay so nga pala guys ha? note lang ha? note lang itong firebolt isa isang backstack siya pagka nag firebolt ka or lightning bolt or cold bolt hindi ko lang alam pagka pinalevel mo siya dadami ba siya or what pero yun, sa experience ko Level 1 Hindi ko na siya kasi pinalevel kasi sobrang tagal ng cast time niya Kaya lang lumakas yan ngayon Ay nag minus 2 yan ngayon Kasi ano eh, uh, sa, sa gamit ko Pero nung nag-uumpisa ako Sobrang tagal ng cast time niya So hindi sulit So yan, pag-uusapan din natin yung mga Yung mga ganyang bagay do sa ano Sa uh, sa guide ko sa ano Sa mage, no? Sa medyo, medyo lumalayo na tayo Pag-uusapan lang natin yung mga skill So yan yung Firebolt and Soul Strike Sound Holy Spirit to attack deal 130% of magic damage plus 320 goes magic damage on enemy deal 5% more to undead monsters no Lightning Bolt call, call down na Lightning Bolt on an enemy 110% magic attack 220 win magic damage okay Firebolt shoot a Firebolt dealing 105% magic attack plus 130% Fire da damage to enemy units within 3 meters of specific location. Heaven's Drive command spike to protrude from the ground near the target. Dealing 100% of magic attack plus 220, no? Tapos cold bolt, cold down an ice bolt on an enemy. 150% magic attack plus 620. Ah, hindi. Naka, ano na yan, eh. Level 5 na kasi yan, kaya plus 620, Nagulat ako eh, laki ng damage eh. Tapos ito, Firewall conjures a ring of fire of sack enemies from advancing, dealing 33% of magic attack plus 25 fire damage to enemies that attempts to the firewall. Last 10, 14 seconds, no? so 10 seconds yung firewall dito. The ring of fire can be abstract of the enemy four time, up to 4 times and will persist at least 3 seconds. Okay? So Zen, increase SP regen, restoring 0.5% of Max SP plus 10 SP every 10 seconds and increase the effectiveness of SP recovery. No, so Frost Diver deals 325 magic attack plus 600 water magic damage. No, 75% chance to freeze them for two seconds. Target armor attribute will. Become water And hindi ko Hindi ko alam yun ha Ganyan diba sa classic Or sa Eternal Lab Parang bago yan The magic depth will be Decreased by 20% So Correct me Pero alam ko Froze lang yun eh May ganyan ganyan ba Attribute dyan sa classic Or what So Tapos na tayo sa mage No Tapos na tayo sa mage Punta na tayo sa second job Which is you wizard No wizard Pagka wizard nyo Pagka job level 50 nyo Ah Note lang din guys So Job level 50 Hindi 40 sya No, kasi sa Eternal Love, di ba, 40 So, sa classic naman, 50 rin, eh, di ba So, sa Eternal Love kasi, nasanay tayo na job level 40, eh, di ba So, job uh, <coughs> 50, makakapag second job na kayo And note lang din, pagka second job nyo Pagka, uh, ano Meron ko yung parang sa image book Pwede nyo na kagad lagyan to, itong mga skill na yun. So, wala, note ko lang yun, and Tata, mas tatalakayin natin yung detail sa guide ko sa wizard no, so ito sa, sa, sa skill sa wizard no, storm gas conjure 7 waves of storms 7 no, waves siya 7 waves nagalon specific to each, each waves deals 32% of 
Magic attack plus 70 water magic damage to enemies in the uh, area and has 36% to slow them by 29%. The slow effect lasts for 3 seconds and can stack up to 3 times. When stuck to 3 times, the enemy will be, will be frozen for 3 seconds. So, pag nag-stack siya na 3 seconds, mapo-froze yung kalaban, which is napakaganda. His target can be only slowed and frozen by one storm gust at any one time. So, hindi pwede, pwede, hindi, hindi pwede magpatong yung storm gust. Hindi pwede magpatong yung dalawang mage. Storm gust, storm gust, hindi siya pwede. Isang storm gust lang siya. When the target is frozen by the skill, it will no longer be affected by the skills slow effect. So, mawawala na skills slow effect pag na-froze na. The skills freeze effect will not be removed when the enemy takes damage. You can, uh, okay. Energy code. Papakuna at envelope yourself with spiritual energy, reducing physical damage by 95% or uh, further reduces physical damage received by 1% for every 50 feet you have no, so sa classic yata o sa eternal love walang beat pagkakatanda ako ha kasi may, matagal na ako ano dyan eh kasi pagkakatanda ako lang so correct niya frame room na lang guys kasi alam ko walang beat na scaling yun dati kung, kung tama ako so correct niya frame room na lang and then next natin soul drain increase max HP plus 20% and increase your magic attack by max SP by 100 no? so kada tumatakas yung SP mo lumalakas yung magic attack mo diba so dito Frost Nova freezes the air nearby dealing 245% magic attack water magic uh, and has a 6% chance freeze them for 3 seconds while the frozen the target armor attribute will become better. The magic damage will be de decreased by 20% and the HP and SP will not recover naturally when the frozen effect is dispelled in advance due to being attacked by water armor attribute. Will proceed for another 3 seconds. No? So, ayan yung mga viable uh, cooldown nila and fixed cooldown. So, dito nga pala guys, so note lang din, meron mga fixed cooldown dito. So, kahit na sobrang taas ng text po or ng ano mo, Pero pa rin siyang fixed cooldown, no? Hindi ka makapag-spam ng skill. E, on certain skill, no? Pero pa rin naman skill na pwede kang makapag-spam. So, next sa atin, Fire Pillar. Sama na Fire Pillar, dealing uh, 195%. Take note, level 5 na yun, guys, ha? So, medyo mataas. Magic attack plus 460. Fire damage to an enemy. If the target is ignited, they will detonate. And deal 90% of magic attack plus 460. Fire magic damage to all units within 3 meters of them. Okay. Jupiter Thunder. Shots a ball of lightning to an enemy dealing 260% magic attack plus 1050 wind magic damage or and knocks them back 4 meters you can adjust them okay so ito ulit yung mga barbell cooldown fix cooldown no? wala siyang cast time Ma mataas ang cooldown niya so dito sa side sama sa fireball dealing 110% of magic attack fire magic damage to enemies within 3 meters and Reveals nearby enemy units who are hiding 10 seconds. Ito, tanda ko to sa origin. Wala siyang damage. Dito may damage siya. Tama ba? Basta yun ang pagkakatanda ko. Reveal lang, ano. So, correct the FM ROM na lang din, guys. Kasi medyo uh, makakalimutin tayo. When the side effect is active, you can latch site Trasher to knock nearby enemy units 4 meters dealing 99% of magic attack plus 396 magic damage standing game for 2 seconds. So, so may stun siya. So, ayan ulit yung ano niya, uh, viable cooldown. So, mapapansin nyo, ang tataas ang cooldown, no? Pag-uusapan natin sa mga guide sa pag-upload ko ng guide ko, no? Dito sa wizard. So, next natin is Kindle. All fire skills have 50% chance to ignite the enemy unit on hit. While under the effect of ignite targets will take fire damage, 50% of casters, magic attack, per 10% fire damage from your... 8 seconds. No? So, passive yan. Passive yan, guys. So, next natin, Lord of Rebellion releases, releases a powerful electric shock at a specific location. Feeling 38% magic damage. Win magic damage to enemies within 6 area, 6 times. So, ang tagal na nga na dito ng Lord of Rebellion has 12% chance to blind uh, ano, uh, enemies in the range for 10 seconds. You can adjust. Okay. So, ayan yung cooldown niya. And fix cooldown, viable cast time, fix cast time, no? 
So, pakita ko sa inyo. Yan, yung Lord of Vermilion. And, yan yung Storm Gas. So, yan yung ginagamit ko ngayon skill pang farm, no? So, yan. Anyway, pag-uusapan natin yan ulit sa pag sa guide ko. So, kung interesa lang kayo doon, like and subscribe na kayo, guys. No? Kasi, upload ko siya. Tapos ito, uh, napalm build. Napalm build. Napalm beat. Attack with a blast, like a kinetic force, dealing uh, 240% of a magic attack, plus 630. Goes a magic attack, the near, near, near modi modify the nearness, the damage will be distributed evenly to all of them, okay? Up to maximum 8 targets, lo, yo. So, good scene yan, yung napanbit na skill. So, next natin is a high vis na tayo, no? Third job na tayo, napanbulkan. Patang sa target consecutively with 5 blasts of telekinetic force, dealing a total of 200%. Magic attack plus 900 Ghost magic damage The skill has 12% to crit So may crit dito yun ano Napalm Vulcan no Sa classic ba may crit ba Ayan sa ano Alam ko wala eh Pagkatanda ako So comment down below nyo lang Kung may crit or what And a 3% chance to curse the target Targets that curse have their attack Reduced by 25% And their movement speed by 50% Tarsh effect last for 10 seconds Okay Meteor Storm and note lang din, Meteor Dawn dito, uh, patagal na patagal yata yung channeling na ito, no? So, sa unang level 1 yan, isang Meteor lang ang ibabaksak yan. So, and so forth, no? Summons 2 Meteors. Ayan, 2 Meteors pala. So, alam ko pagka, ano yan, pagka level mo yan, pag parami ng parami Meteor Storm, eh. Kung di ako nagkakamali. Chance to stun the target, 3 seconds. Okay, Chain Lightning, next skill natin. This is 80% of magic attack plus 50 wind magic damage on enemy if the enemy units are near the target. Chain item with automatic bounce so, and any hit them bouncing up to 2 times. There are no other targets so the... To chain lightning will deal the remaining damage to current target up to 2 times, no? So, intense is telekinesis. So, passive to. Itong napan Vulcan and napan beat. At to the magical enemy mode, ghost attribute getting into optimal condition of ghost magic and channel spells at high speed after using ghost attribute skill so passive nga siya nung ghost skill no there is a 11% chance to gain 6% ghost attribute enhanced for 6 seconds no so next skill natin abyssal swamp creates a quagmire with radius of 4 meters at a specific location enemy units within the quagmire will have their movement speed and attack speed decrease by 14% the quagmire last for 7 seconds and units in the quagmire have a 12% chance per se second of their armor attribute to switch to earth this earth attribute will, uh, will last for 3 seconds this is still ineffective against MVP Nini and boss monsters okay so ayan yung cooldown nya earth spike calls earth spike to earth from the ground dealing 200% magic attack plus 380 Earth magic damage to enemy units within 4 meters The skill has 23% to stun the target for 3 seconds So napakarami stun ng, ano, no, ng wish dito We can adjust the Okay Safety wall Ang safety wall nya nasa high wish Create a barrier at the specific location you, you and all power will be immune to physical damage for 11 seconds Within the barrier But can take up to 3 hits So 3 hits pa rin Rapidly up, amplify. So, next skill natin is gravitational field. Rapidly amplifies the gravity at the specific location, dealing 21% of magic attack plus 123 earth magic damage for every 4, 0.5 seconds to enemy units within the area for 2.3 with the 12% to stun. Then, for 2 seconds, if the target was not stunned, slows them by 40 seconds. For 4 seconds Okay So next skill natin Magic Amplification Active skill siya After using this skill It creates a magic attack oh, For party members Within 30 meters By 1% For 3, 30 seconds Okay So yun Yun na lahat guys Lahat na skill no? From mage To wizard Into high whiz, no? So yun na lahat ng skill niya And yun Sana nakatulong ako Makapag Decide kung mag Mag-uwi, mag-mage ba kayo sa paparating na na si server ng rocks or what and yun so stay tuned sa sa guide ko sa sa wiz no pero yun hanggang level 40 lang kasi itong wiz ko kasi gumagawa rin ako ng ano ng ibang character and 
yon kasi gusto ko mapakita ko sa inyo lahat ng skills ng jobs kasi napaka importante na sobrang dapat uh, magustuhan niyo yung job na nilalaro niyo kasi sobrang grind din ng laro and kung magpapalit pa kayo ng job sa inyo oras na mawawala sa inyo no so yon eto gumawa ako ng video para makatulong makapag-decide sa inyo kung i-take niyo ba yung job na na mage pagdating uh, ng uh, open beta ng this June 18 or hindi and yun stay tuned lang guys sa ibang uh, job job ko pa na ano na mga iba pang jobs no na skill na papakita ko sa inyo lahat ng skill so yun maraming kung nakaabot kayo dito sa part ng video ito please do like share and subscribe ang ating channel no so yun and leave a comment no kung kung magme-mage kayo sa upcoming uh, open beta ng de, beta ng Ragnarok X no so yeah so kita kayo sa next video ko maraming salamat sa panonood okay peace